All right, I am going to speed through this as quickly as possible because this is like my third time trying to get this in one take and each time it has been an absolute disaster. So this is my first video back since March, which I think is what? March, April, May, June, four months. Yeah, a lot happened. So in mid-March, we had a small, very small kitchen fire, but it did ruin the whole of our um, cooking space, basically. Um, I'll put a photo in here. And that kind of just threw me off my momentum. I was getting two videos out a week the month before, and I was feeling great. I was doing fantastic. And then that happened and just kind of me messed with my mental state. What's that? What's that? Um, and yeah, so I didn't do so good for them. And then I found out. Yeah, darling. I love you. Um, I then found out, I think either that week or later that week, that we were expecting baby number two. Um, so, which is very exciting for us because we did one of our little, little Bubba and our Zayden will be two years old, almost two years old when Bub's born. So, my due date is November 15. I'm hoping, hoping to go on time again, not, do not want to go late. Um, yeah, so that was fantastic news, but coming along with finding out that I'm pregnant. Obviously, first trimester wasn't going to be great. Um, wasn't great last time. I pretty much lost, I lost the same amount of weight this time, six kilos straight away in the first trimester. Um, just because I basically couldn't eat all day and then I'd eat one thing and then still feel really sick. So, salty chips with my friend, hot showers with my friend. Um, medication that kind of helped with dizziness was my best friend too and just not eating any of my food allergies because those were making me throw up but we got through that and I'm now how far along I'm now 20 weeks 20 weeks let me check on my app 21 weeks and two days but according to their According to like the doctor's measurements and stuff, I'm, I'd still be in my 20 weeks. I think they're about four days different from when I calculated my, my, um, due date. So, yeah, so I'm about 20 weeks pregnant. We're going to go for our 20 week scan, which is very exciting. Fingers crossed. Everything goes well. Um, yeah. So... I, as you can tell in the title, we also found out the gender, which was something. I'm sorry, guys. This is just. He's, he has to bring his giant toy. Yeah. Give it two minutes. with it um yeah so as you can tell by the title yeah that's you darling we did find out <laughs> come here come here no touching yep you can sit down and look um we did find out the gender <laughs> who was i to think i get this done in one go with a one-year-old, huh? With a one-year-old. Not happening, is it? Yeah, should have done this while he was asleep. Um, yeah, so at 14 weeks, that was a mouthful, we did find out the gender, which was different from last time, and we never found out, and that was a real surprise, but... This time I could not, I could not go nine months and not know what it was. 
Um, I was set on having, thinking I was having a boy. My husband was set on ha us having a girl. And a lot of people around me were hoping it was a girl, but thinking it was a boy. So everyone was like a little bit divided. Um, and so when we were in there, they did the 3D ultrasound first. So you kind of got to see the baby moving around. And we were, well, we thought we saw the gender. We were like, okay, we're definitely having another boy. Looked like we were having another boy. We were waiting for the lady to do the scan of the gender, but we were already like, okay, yeah, we've seen it. Um, anyway, so she does the 3D scan. She then does the actual anat anatomy scan, gender scan. Um, and she shocked us by saying it was a girl. We were not expecting it. We were 100% sure, well, I was 100% sure that I was having a boy and not a girl. But we are definitely having a, I don't know if you can tell, a little girl. Sorry, the ring lighting is not the best lighting. This is just going down the paper, isn't it? Okay. <laughs> I'm going to quickly do the rest of this vlog style because everything is a disaster i just 10 minutes is all i asked for to film this video really wouldn't take me that long but you gotta work with what you gotta work with and i have a dog and a child so we found out we were having a little girl which is very exciting um not what we expected but very grateful and just means I get to shop for baby girl clothes. I really thought I was going to be reusing my baby boy stuff. Oh no. Did you flick yourself? Um, yeah, so I thought I was going to be reusing my baby boy stuff. But I'm not. I get to go shopping, which is very nice. And yeah. So he's going to be almost... Zayden will be almost two when... <laughs> almost two when baby girl is born so I don't know if he's gonna get the concept of a, having a baby in the house right away and try and do things too but we're really gonna try and make sure that we spend plenty of time with him because oh you can see where Zayden was sleeping you'll see it in the next vlog why um yeah just to make sure that he doesn't feel left out with number two coming along um we have photos from from the um i'll do a better shot in a minute from the uh, place that we went to so yeah it's all very exciting for us and I'm sorry, I'm so distracted in the at the moment. I'm gonna go and try and edit this video since I'm gonna have to. Um, but yeah, just wanted to fill you in. And also, the kitchen is fixed up. I know we're really kind of glazed over. Our kitchen's all done. Feeling motivated again. Hopefully, I can. I'm gonna try and put two videos out a week, but. I don't know, man. My energy levels have been so downhill. I'm going to go. I'm going to quickly show you this um, the other way. So, yeah, that's her there. We do have a video, which is really cute. And I watched that for, like, days straight. <laughs> I just watched it every day when I was in bed, feeling still feeling a bit unwell. I would do that. Um, yeah, this one's really cute, I think, too. She's, like, holding her little head. I can't wait for the 20-week ones because she's going to be so much bigger and more developed. 